First of all, let's draw a rectangle to represent the painting. So this painting is 12 by 8 inches and surrounded by a uniformed frame. So let's draw another rectangle represent the frame. Okay, so let's label it. This one is 12, this one is 8. Let's assume. I know it's not in the right proportional. So the frame, since we don't know the width of the frame, so let the width to be x. So that really means from here to here is about x unit. Same thing to the other hand side is also x unit. So and this one is also un x unit. Same thing, this side, x unit. So now the total area, the painting and the frame is 192 square inches. So as we know, the, since this is a rectangular box, to find the area of the rectangular, that would be length times width. You know, length times the width equal to the area. Now, we want to know the, what's the length of this rectangular box. Since we know, start from this point to this point, that's 12 inches. Each side, we add x inches. So the total, that will be 12 plus 2x. The width, that will be the same idea. So since we know from this point to this point, that's 8 inches. Add two sides, which each side is x inches. So that will be 8 plus 2x. Therefore, we can plug it in. So since we know the length is 12 plus 2x, the width is 8 plus 2x, and the total area is 192. Now, to solve this equation, first of all, we're going to distribute it. We are going to use a FOIL to do 12 times 8. 12 times 8, which gives us 96. So we get 96. Now, we do 12 times 2x. That will be plus 24x. Now, we do inner. 2x times 8, 16x. 2x times 2x, which is 4x squared, equal to 192. Now we try to reorganize the left hand side and at the same time combine like term. So we get 4x squared plus 40x plus 96 equal to 192. Now we can subtract 192 on both hand side. Subtract 192 on both hand side. Once we do that, we get 4x squared plus 40x minus 96 equal to 0. Well, since 4 is the common factor, so why don't we divide everything by 4? So if we divide everything by 4, we get x squared plus 10x minus 96 divided by 4, that would be 24, equal to 0. Trinomial, we can factor it. x squared, we can factor x times x. 24 12 times 2 give us 24. Since we want positive 10, we have to have positive 12 and negative 2 equal to 0. So solve this one, we get x plus 12 equal to 0. Or x minus 2 equal to 0. So we get x equal to negative 12. or x equal to 2. But think about it. Since we are talking about the width of the frame, therefore we are not able to have negative solutions. Therefore we have to reject this one. This one is out. So the correct solution, that will be x equal to 2. The width of the frame is 2 inches.